what's up guys today we're going on an adventure and it brings us great pleasure to take you along with us all the steps all the stops to our final destination which will be at the beautiful turtles nest villa located in treasure beach jamaica <laughs> When you go on a road trip, you have to make a couple stops and things. But the first thing you know, we have to pack up the car. And if you know anything about Jamaica, what by Fabian and I, we have a toddler. So you know, say any type of outing, any type of vacation, we are going to walk with one bunch of stuff. So we make sure that we have all the necessities for ourselves, we have all our equipment and everything that our toddler needs. On this trip, also, we were fortunate enough to have some friends accompanying us. So our, our friend Jermaine, Lisa and their children, which is great for us because our daughter have company now on this trip, right? So without further ado, I want to show you how the property looks. So here is the main villa. And of course you are used to me giving you a 
in-house tour first but i feel like i want to give you an outside tour before i show you what inside looks like so if you know treasure beach any at all turtles nest villa is located on old wharf road that's the vicinity of jack Spratt, not too far away from there so for here it's more so of a relaxing you want to unwind with your friends your family or that significant other it, this is the right place to come don't worry about the dogs they are very very friendly so if you're a person who are who is afraid of animals like me no need to worry so right here takes us onto the pool deck so the pool deck here what i love about it it is very very spacious so this villa it accommodates six persons and the pool deck can more than accommodate that as you can see so you have space so you can lay down you can have your meals here and it is shaded which is a plus because you know sometimes in jamaica here the sun can be so brutal so you can choose to have your meals inside or even outside you have the shady no problem and here now to fabian's favorite part is the pool what is a vacation property without a pool wonderful pool and it is not too deep i think it goes to four feet here i think it goes all the way up to eight feet please be careful when you're here because there are no lifeguards on property so you know exercise some caution when you're utilizing the pool and i know you're loving this tour so far so as we continue i just want you to know that this villa is three bedrooms it has three and a half bathrooms so you can come with some friends come with family and split the fee and you know just just the fact that you have the entire property yourselves i think it's just a great way that you can you know take a vacation with persons who are close to you and on to my favorite part now is the boardwalk which takes you to the balcony that gives you a beautiful ocean view of the treasure beach i think this is a calabash calabash beach calabash bay i presume on our first trip here this was always a spot that we would come especially at night the view is just incredible if you're a person who appreciates nature you appreciate natural sounds just the whole ambience and the whole relaxing feel of this place trust me it is it is something that you can't even put a price on it so if you can look the sound of the waves the ambience the sand you can even go there's a step here that you can also take a walk down to the beach you can go down there with your family or significant other but please again exercise some caution because the waves here are very rough and they also advise based on the sign there no swimming so it is advised that it doesn't matter how good of a swimmer you are please for your safety no swimming but it is still great you can sit on the shore you know you can put your feet in the water or you can take some um a stroll on the beach incredible right now what i really love about this place is that It depends on what you are looking for in a vacation you can definitely get it here and you have many spots on the property that you can just chill out you can have a good time so for example here under this patio you have light here so you can come out here at night you have outlets here so you know you can enjoy a game of dominoes here you can enjoy a card game here or you can sit and read here while watching the waves and listening to the sound of the waves so it all depends on what you are looking for you can get it here you see me stepping back because i just can't wait to show you inside the house
I forgot to mention also that there is a grill provided there. So if it is that you want to do any outdoor grilling, barbecuing, you can do that. On our journey here, we made a couple stops because at this property, you can hire a, a chef. There is a chef provided that if you require the services of the chef, you know, you pay a small fee and the chef would come and prepare your meals for you. Fortunately for us, we have a chef among us. I won't say who. So we had to stop along the way, you know, to get some fresh produce. We got some scallion, we got some tomato, we got some onions, we got fruits to blend our fruit smoothies because I don't know if you noticed, I've been slimming down because I gave up sugar for a Lent, you know, so we got all of that. And we have a fully stocked fridge so we have utensils, we have all the equipment, we have everything that we need to prepare our meals. So we just decided that we're going to utilize our chef to do just that. And speaking of kitchen and meals, right at the back patio here takes us into the beautiful kitchen. But this door seems to be locked. So let us go around. So you have more than one entrances for the kitchen. You actually have three. This one is locked as well. So we have some kids with us so for safety. We lock them because we don't want them to veer off into the pool because you know how dangerous that is. So here we are into the beautiful kitchen. So we have all the necessities here. So if it is that you decide to prepare your own meals all you need to do is just walk with your food they have all the, the utensils they have a table here that seats comfortably i would say six or six persons um you know good space table and i can see that it is clean we also have adequate counter space you know to do your prepping and you know anything that you want to put here counter space is something that we take for granted until you're actually preparing meals and then you realize it is so chaotic when you don't have enough counter space so that's a great thing um so we have our full blasting water we have a dish drainer here we have coasters cutting board we have an electric kettle toaster knives all the utensils microwave of course, a stove, oven, and I can see here that they have been so kind to provide certain condiments and so for us, like your local salt and seasonings. I see vegetable oil in there, you know. So, as I said, you come to prepare your meals. You, you just bring your stuff, bring the chicken and the rice, and you can prepare it, you know. And here you also have you know enough plates bowls cups we have a bin here we have a refrigerator here with ice you see some stuff in there so I, I i guess that sometimes when guests before come if it is certain items you know that can roll over they leave them in the fridge and all that and speaking of food again it was a must coming to saint elizabeth I love it here because there are certain spots that you're gonna pass. One of them was Alan Bamboo. We definitely had to drive through Alan Bamboo to come here to get some refreshing coconut water. That was a must for me. Also, a little bit beyond Alan Bamboo, we know that you're entering middle quarters. The best shrimp in Jamaica, hands down. So we got some of that as well. Now, enough of the kitchen, I'm going to show you the rest of the house. So right here is the half bathroom. So remember I said it's three bedrooms, three and a half bathrooms. So this is basically like a powder room where you can come, you run in, you know, you don't use the bathroom, you freshen up or whatever the case. And in here is your living room. So adequate seating again, again, this property um, should accommodate six persons and there is more than enough space for six persons to be here You know for some entertainment watch a movie or anything like that 
and again there's also another door there that takes you onto the pool deck so basically any room that you're in downstairs you have direct access to the pool which is a must because you know many of us don't have pools at home you know so when we come to these properties we want to enjoy the pool if you watched our other video where we showcased this property we had mentioned that the owners were so creative that they accessorized the villa with sea creatures turtles as the name suggests turtles nest villa you will see a lot of turtles and seashells octopus you know around the place so i really love the decor of here it's great for pictures and i just did i just love the minimalistic comfortable but very creative and good use of space as well all right so we're gonna take you now to the first bedroom so the first bedroom so this is the only bedroom on the ground floor it has a king size bed and a bathroom so with all the 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 amenities that you would think of air conditioning ac again as i said before all rooms downstairs have direct access to the pool and the pool deck so we have direct access here so you're in this room and you just want to take a uh, a swim or so you can just open and go so for persons who would have small children please just be vigilant with the doors and so and to protect protect the children and here is the bathroom they have provided us with you know soap lotion body wash uh, we should have hot and cold water they provided towels again the deco decor that you have like you have never seen before love it and we actually got some inspiration with our home too we have something similar to this our vanity is similar to this and we were inspired by turtles nest villa so thank you lucy <laughs> all right so that's enough for the first bedroom upon exiting you can see over the left over the right here my right that you have a closet so you can put away your stuff they provided a blanket i'm seeing there they also provide hangers and you see these you see them something here them look so simple but you see when you don't have them you realize how important they are there's also a safe in there and they also provide a blow dryer which is great so you can see that the owner she really she really I guess she really sat and thought of okay a vacation adults just adults or adults coming with children what are the things that they would need to make their vacation great you know what is something that i can provide that they don't have to take from home i get that here you know so you just come with your clothes and your your, your gadgets and, and whatever and you're all set all right so that's enough for downstairs and we're gonna take you now upstairs where the other two bedrooms are so upon going upstairs you see that we have safety railings which is great very sturdy and on the landing here we have a serviced fire extinguisher so again the owners are putting everything in place it is serviced so god forbid if there should be an event where we need to use it then it's there now to the second bedroom i assume that this bedroom would be fitting for two small children or if it's just adults that would be great as well so as with the downstairs rooms where you have direct access to the patio all of the rooms upstairs you have a direct view of the ocean so whether you're downstairs or upstairs you're still getting you know a great experience here so this room unlike the other room that has one king size bed this has two double beds and it also has an ensuite bathroom so all of the rooms have them own bathroom and here you see that they basic they really tailor this room for children 
because unlike the other bathroom this has a tub rather than a standing shower and on and just like that side You know, so for this room, we have some little accessories again. We have a ceiling fan. We have an AC. If you're, not, if you're not an AC person. You can also utilize natural air, natural ventilation. Wonderful. All right, so we're gonna make a walk now to the final bedroom, which is my favorite bedroom. So this, I presume, would be the master bedroom. And it has a similar layout to the other bedroom downstairs. Upon entering on your left, you have a walk-in closet. Um, um, an ironing board is provided, a blanket is inside. You have hangers inside, adequate space for your items so you don't have to have clutter all over the room. You come, you just put your, your suitcases inside there. Uh, king size bed in here. And again, a wide window that gives a beautiful view of the ocean. Air conditioning. We have a fan inside here. And again, we have an ensuite bathroom with a standing shower. So beautiful. Are you in love yet? I, I cannot get enough of this place. So again, our inspiration for our bathroom at home came from here. I'm really loving the mirror as well. So beautiful. It's accessorized with um, seashells. And I believe that the items that are used to accessorize this home are locally sourced. I believe they're, they're sourced from right here in Treasure Beach. So that's great. Well, I sad to see you go, but I can't wait to just, I was, I was gonna say let my hair down, but my hair is already down. But last and not least, we're gonna take you now onto this patio area. So here, this is a new addition also. From here, there is a step here that takes you directly down to the pool deck. So if you're here and you wanna take a dip, you wanna take a swim, you can go all the way down and you would be right there on the pool deck. Other than that, if you just wanna come here, you wanna you know, you want to sit, look at the waves, you want to read, you want to just sit and hang, you want to chat, you can do it here. So the layout of this property is just, is just, is just so great because it depends on if you're, if you're an outdoor person, there are so many different spots that you can, you know, sit and hang. If you're an indoors person, even better because the living room, the bedrooms, it is so spacious and it is so laid out that if if it's for entertainment purposes or you just want to come here and just relax you can definitely get that so turtles nest villa definitely among my top picks for vacation properties you can visit their website at www.turtlesnestja.com they are also on instagram follow them on instagram you can also look at our previous video of turtles nest villa that we posted definitely consider this place for a vacation it is so worth it and you just can't go wrong you can't go wrong so definitely look out in our community section and in our short section and our instagram posts subsequent instagram posts for you know our whole experience here it is going to be a vibe i'm sure the kids are gonna have a great time and you know that's it that was a mouthful so i hope you enjoyed this video and if you do 
please give a thumbs up. Please also follow us on Facebook. The Facebook is Fabian Allen and in brackets, it's Jamaica Walk by. We're gonna put it in the description below. So we're trying to build our Facebook community. So if you haven't done so as yet, if you have a Facebook page, like it. If you don't have a Facebook page, page please create one so that you can follow us there because we will be posting some things that might not be on our YouTube. So if you wanna see some extra additional things, you know, you run go over to our Facebook page. So until next time, we're gonna jerk some chicken now, cook some food, blend up some fruit juice, and enjoy ourselves. So until then, I'll see you the next time at another property, if you can carry me somewhere nice again, I will come back here so again, whichever one come first. Love you all.